Maybe this whole thing is fate, you know? A chance for you to start eating better, you know? Stick around a little longer and burp less. Well, when I first read Carrie, because I was not deciding if I wanted to do the show or not, they kept watering her down. So the script that I saw, I wasn't too happy with, because I was like, no wife in America, you know, is going to fall for this crap. Enough already. What is your problem? What's my problem? OK, well, ever since you stopped eating meat and started reading, you've been acting like an ass. <laughs> OK, how long are you going to keep this up? OK, first of all, don't like the language. <laughs> Second of all, this is forever. This is for life. Oh my God. Would you stop it already? Stop what? That whole thing where you say something and then pause for emphasis and then say the same exact thing, only slightly differently. It's so sickening, man. So Carrie was just the wife, you know, <laughs> in the show until I came aboard. And then she was a, a legal secretary and it seemed like she really wanted a lot of, out of life. She also kind of ran the household, which I liked, and put this man in line. Keys? To our apartment in the city. I, I don't want to do it. What? I don't want to move. Doug, what do you, you said you were OK with this, that my dream was your dream. Yeah, I only said that because I know we couldn't do it because of your father. Oh, God. <laughs> the qualities that I really, really, really admired about Carrie was that she, uh, family came first to her. It was no question that her father would live with them and that Doug was the kind of man that was like, absolutely, he needs to live with us, you know? He's done this like a million times before. He moves out and then he comes right back here. He's like an old wrinkly boomerang. No, it's different this time. I know it. Uh, why? Because he's marrying a complete stranger? Do, do you even know her name? Of course I know her name. It's Ava. Ava something. Oh, that's good daughtering right there. You don't even know her last name. I know what it's going to be. Spooner. <laughs> Come on. Give me some knuckles on that one, buddy. <laughs> So I, I really admired that about her as a character. And then she also had some chutzpah. So all of those things together was just attracted me to Carrie.